Yeah, mate, I'm in the Red Cliff Massive. Red Cliff, mate, and uh, it's no relation to the cat called Heathcliff, mate. It's Red Cliff. It's a little part of Bristol. And the reason why it's called Red Cliff, mate, is because originally there was a Red Cliff here, mate, which makes perfect sense, mate, but technically it was a Black Cliff, mate, but it got sprayed with red spray paint and it became Red Cliff, and uh, that's pretty much mate, how it got to be called uh, the Red Cliff Massive, basically. And uh, ever since then, mate, they knocked the cliff down because of the vandals, and. Uh, they started building houses here and uh, it's now called the uh, Red Cliff Massive because people still remember the time when we originally was here, mate, that there was Red Cliffs here, mate. But now, mate, it's not, mate, it's like concrete paradise, mate, literally. So we're going to look around the Red Cliff Massive, mate, and uh, see what's going on, mate, and see if we can find out more about the Red Cliffs, mate, innit? If there's one thing, though, mate, I've noticed about Red Cliff Massive, mate, it's skyscrapers, mate. Everywhere you look, mate, skyscraper, 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 mate, and uh, it's like, well, hang on a minute, mate, how many people actually live around here? I reckon, like, looking at it all, mate, like, 99% of the population probably live down here, mate, and they're all putting these skyscraper blocks, mate, to keep them out of trouble or something like that, mate. But it's probably huge, mate, everywhere you look, mate, it's like another skyscraper, mate, it's mental, mate, mental, literally. I also reckon, mate, if it's been Sunday, it'd been a lot more busier down here, mate. Oh, there's a Premier Inn, mate. Proper good place if you get a lady of the night, mate, if you know what I mean. And uh, they're pretty quiet on what you bring back, if you know what I mean, mate. And then you can have a wee wee of a good time, mate. You know, having a cooking, being taught how to cook or something like that, mate. What did you think I mean, mate? What did you think I meant? So, um, we're going, um, well, mate, it's getting a bit windy down here. Um, so what we've got here, mate, we've got summer fields delivering here, mate, not much here. It's almost like something like, you've got Castle War, Hawkshaw, Costco, whatever that is, mate. I don't know what it is, mate. It doesn't make sense to me. And um, even Bob the Builder's famous down here, mate. Proper Bob the Builder can't leave this place alone, mate. It's like his wet dream or something like that. And everywhere you look around here, mate, it's Bob the Builder this, Bob the Builder that, mate. Look at that skyscraper, mate. That's massive. In all fairness, mate, if you live in Redcliffe, mate, you can guarantee 95% of the people watching this video are probably a student at the moment, mate, and uh, they're, like, sat there, mate, fighting over uh, who can borrow, like, um, who can borrow Emma's or Becky's airbrush or something like that, mate. This place, mate, is so full of high-class students, mate, that think they're better than everybody else, mate. Some of you, not all of you, but we all know one, mate, thinks, hey, I'm a bit better than you around this part, mate. And, um, basically, mate, what we've got here, mate, is student complex, but this place here, mate, probably doesn't even get any trouble down here, mate. Literally, I reckon it's as, uh, as quiet as anything, mate, literally. Because it just doesn't seem that kind of place, mate, where they get uh, trouble around here, these parts, mate. I mean, it's not like it's not like it's St Paul's Massive, mate, or anything like that, mate. Poor. Don't want to talk about St Paul's, mate. That's gangster down there, mate, literally. So, um, we're going to have a little look around, mate. There's a ferry, mate. There's a ferry. I like ferries. It's got a grommet on it as well. That's well good. Yes, mate. Hello. Hi. Yeah, mate. Well, happy, mate. They waved at me, mate. They like me. They do, mate. They like me. I like you, people. I like you. Well, happy, mate. They're all friendly down here, mate. They just said hello to me when I waved at them. I think I've got some new best friends, mate. I'll call them. We'll call them Bill and Ben, I think. Another thing, mate, I've noticed, mate, is everywhere you look around Redcliffe, mate, there's water. It's almost like this place is trying to be that place called Venice, is it, in Italy or wherever it is, mate? But it's never going to be that, mate, but it likes to think it is, mate. It thinks it's a bit, a bit, a bit Italy, I reckon, mate. So um, we're walking around like a square at the moment, mate, and uh, you're not allowed to swim in there, mate, because if you swim in there, mate, well, you're pretty much going to get a fine, mate, aren't you? So um, we're going to cross the bridge back over here, mate, and find what else is going on. Redcliffe is also like a maze, mate. Look, you go one way, mate, you've got to come back around the other way. It's like a... John Yorma's maze or something like that, mate, and uh, you need, like, Harry Potter and his magical flying Nimbus, whatever it's called, mate, to get across from one side to the other, mate, and uh, not even a bit of Expelliarmus is going to get you around these parts, mate. So we're looking around to see if we can find a shop, mate. I haven't even seen a cop yet, and everywhere's got a cop, but around here, mate, they haven't got one, it seems, mate. Proper, that's mento. Another thing this place seems to be known for, mate, I found out, is pricks in suits, mate. Literally, your working class business busybody, mate that basically walks around all day in a suit, like, yeah, I've got, I've got a couple of hundred quid a day kind of thing, you know, and uh, one of those kind of people, mate, and uh, 
they they seem to be around here quite a lot, mate. Even on a Sunday, mate, they seem to be around here in their um, little little blazers, mate. Trying to make themselves look like they're a bit better than everybody else around here, mate. When really they ain't, mate. Really, they're just some little busybody, mate. It's probably cheating on his wife or husband or something like that, mate. And uh, boss, I wouldn't mind having a thought one of those business people, mate, and putting them in boss, mate, and showing them who's daddy, mate, and who's boss around these parts. This looks interesting, mate. I wonder if they'll run around this, mate, for the fun of it, mate. But it's broken, mate. They they obviously don't want me over here, mate, and you know, I have to run around it, mate, and then, like, jump out at the last second and get myself chinned by the door, mate. But, how far they tell to go, mate? I'm well unhappy with that, mate. I want a bit of fun with that and uh, get myself into a bit of, bit of trouble, mate. Proper. But now, nah, mate, they've got to close it, mate, because they send me coming, I reckon, mate. Drop a yeah, mate. Well, mate, it's not much more I can really say about it, mate, other than the fact that... Proper what's that, mate? It's a... It's a bit of a can, mate. I kicked it, mate. You see that? I kicked it flying, mate. Nah, other than that, mate, there's not a lot really going on, mate. If you're, like, a busybody in a suit, mate, or you're a student, mate, then Redcliffe is definitely the place for you, mate, but... If you're a person of my degree of taste, mate, you ain't going to fit into Redcliffe, mate, literally. And uh, unless you go and like these faces around the lights and cliffs, mate, and get them called the Redcliffe Massive. So really, mate, that's pretty much it around these parts, mate. Other than the fact that I think I ever wanted to like, go rob a businessman, mate. I think I'll come up here, mate, to do some robbing, mate, because they're all, they're all, in, they're all businessmen here, mate. They're all quite rich around these parts, mate. So probably, mate, if you wanted to, like, I don't know, say, like... You wanted to get in some crime, mate, and you wanted to go rob somebody, mate. I want to encourage you to rob people in this area, mate, because it's proper all right down here, mate. You can make a living out of this. So big up the Red Cliff Massive, innit?